Hello and welcome to pdf.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can convert your PDF files in Google Drive to JSON format using pdf.com. Before you perform the steps explained in this video, you should have an account with pdf.co as well as with Zapier and you should also know how to connect Zapier with pdf.co. If you do not already know how to connect Zapier with pdf.co, I have made a video on that and the link to that video is provided in the description of this video. So uh, let's begin without any ado. Click make a zap. Then from this list, select Google Drive. We want that whenever a new file is added to a folder, that file should be converted to JSON. So the event will be new file in folder. Click continue. Here you have to select your Google Drive account. So click your account name, click continue. And then you have to select your drive name. Uh, my drive name is my Google Drive. So I simply select it. And then you have to select the folder in which the files uploaded will be converted to JSON. So in my case, I select this, you can select your own folder and click continue. Finally, you have to test your trigger and your trigger is successful. Next, we want that whenever a file is uploaded to Google Drive, that file should be converted to JSON. To do so, we need pdf.co. So we'll click continue. And from the list of applications, you will select pdf.co. If you do not see pdf.co here in the list, simply type pdf.co here and you will see pdf.co appear here. So select pdf.co. Here you have to choose your action event. Basically you want to convert PDF to anything converter and then click continue. Here you have to select your pdf.co account. Make sure you are logged into your pdf.co account. So select your pdf.co account name, click continue. Here the output format should be JSON. So select JSON and in PDF URL select embed link from Google Drive. Finally click continue and test and review your trigger. So uh, your converter is, is successful. That means our Zap is basically converting PDF documents to JSON format. So the last step is to turn on your Zap. Click here. Here you can share your Zap with other users and also rename and add description to your Zap. So if you click share and then click add a name and description, here you can give any name to your Zap. So I will name it Google. PDF Co. JSON Zap because it is a we have to specify minimum 20 characters. So um, in description, this Zap converts PDF docs in Google Drive to JSON format using PDF.co. And then you simply have to click save. And that's pretty much it. So this is how you can create a Zap that converts PDF documents in Google Drive to JSON using PDF.co. Thank you for watching this video.